grown man business. All right, got another episode of Red Ghost Sports Talk. I'm your host, Red Ghost. You already know, you see this hat right here, you know you know what that means, right? College football talk, baby. And uh, this weekend, tomorrow, it's going to say a whole lot, baby. It's going to say grown man business all through the TV right here. All right, tonight, they got, um, who is it, Bowling Green against Northern Illinois. I guess I guess you call that a, 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 a sampler, an appetizer. Uh, I like Bowling Green on this one, man, but it's hard to tell uh, who's going to win that game between them two. Uh, Northern Illinois, you know, I won't. I won't sleep on them, but I go for Bowling Green in that one. But let's talk about tomorrow. Mm. Ah, just, I'm trying to stay calm, man. I'm trying to stay calm. You see my eyes? I'm trying to stay calm. But uh, we got Texas versus Bella. Bella's ranked number 12. That's at noon tomorrow, man. Texas is going to try to come out and play, baby. They trying to make a statement tomorrow against Bella. This is a rivalry. Understand that. They do not like each other. I like Bella. But it's hard to tell, man. You know, it's hard to tell who's going to, you know, what, what Texas team is going to come out. I'm going to go with uh, Bella. I'm going to say 38-17 uh, to 17 Bella. Uh, Temple versus Houston. Temple is ranked number 20. Houston is ranked number 17. We know Houston lost that that um that game maybe two was it two weeks ago against UConn. That was a stunner. That was a real surprise right there. I like Houston in this one though. It's at noon also. Uh Houston, Tom Herman, he got them guys playing some good football over there, man. Some good college football. Uh they playing the way the game should be played. Uh I mean a high flying high uh, caliber type offense them guys is all over the field man they doing reverses they they jumping up and catching the ball with one hand they they doing some they doing some good some good um inside entertaining uh things on the offensive side i like that the defense not is not that bad either so um i'm gonna take houston over temple and uh this game here i'm gonna say 56 to, uh, to 35 man houston Okay, here we go, baby. Florida Gators, ranked number 18. You know, they lost to Florida State last week against the number two ranked Alabama, baby. The road tide, I've been saying it each week. I said they're getting stronger. After that loss to Ole Miss, I said they're getting stronger, man. They are getting stronger each week. Henry, Derek Henry is playing some, some good football. Tell you the truth, I think he he deserved that uh, Heisman uh, trophy, baby. I'm gonna do an episode about that later on today. Who should be, uh, who y'all think should be, you know, runner up, winner of the Heisman? Uh, who's the best running backs? You know, between Henry, uh, 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 Fournette, uh, there's a couple other guys to my name also. But I'm gonna take Alabama over Florida Gators. It's gonna be a massacre, man. Let's say uh, 30 to 10. That game is at 4 o'clock tomorrow. Stanford versus USC. Stanford's ranked number 7. USC is ranked uh, number 24. I'm, I'm kind of surprised they still rank, man. The type of season they had, man. It's been up and down for them. But Stanford had a big upset against uh, that victory over Notre Dame last week. what I say? what I say? But, uh, all right, Stanford, USC, this is a, this is a true, a true rivalry, baby. This is, um, this is history right here. These teams know each other. And don't get me wrong, USC going to come out playing. They're going to come out to play. Uh, they're going to play hard, matter of fact. But that defense with Stanford, man, I love it. I love it. So I'm going to take uh, Stanford over USC. That game's at 745. I'm going to say the score is going to be 38 to 28. Stanford. Oh, 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 oh. grown man business right here, baby. 
grown man business right here. North Carolina versus Clemson. North Carolina's ranked number eight. Clemson's ranked number one. We know that. Hey, I smell an upset. Yeah, I said it. I smell an upset, baby. North Carolina gonna beat Clemson. That game is at 8 o'clock, baby. The whole world's gonna watch that game. Yeah. North Carolina's gonna beat Clemson. The score gonna be 38 to 35 in the thriller. Okay, Michigan State versus Iowa. Michigan State's ranked number five. Iowa's ranked number four. All right, let's go, Buck. Robbie Todd, I'm giving y'all some shout outs, man. Because y'all y'all the college guys, man. Uh, y'all the college guys that talk about your Florida State and, and, and your Ohio States. And uh, this this the games we've been talking about for pretty much all week. I'm taking Iowa, baby. I like Michigan State with that defense. And I, I need to get matching man on this one. I might do that tomorrow, have him talk about Michigan State uh, before the game come on. They come on, it's 8 17 p.m. tonight, tomorrow night. Well, I'm taking Iowa, man. It's going to be a close one right here. It's going to be 42 to 38. Iowa. I love that running game they got, man. I love it. They got a good running game, and I think they could beat up on that defense, man. Michigan State, they weighing down a little bit. They all wearing down. They've been they've been in some wars this year already, and they might be a uh, a little beat up. So I'm gonna, I think I was gonna. I mean, first quarter first quarter they're not gonna get too many rushing yards uh, on Michigan State. It's the third quarter and fourth quarter I'm talking about, baby. They're gonna pound pound and ground them all day until they wear them out. That's gonna be a good game. That's the game I'm ready to see. All right. There go my picks from college football. I want to know what's y'all opinions. Comment, like, hit the like button, share these videos. Let's keep growing, baby. We almost at 150 uh, subscribers. We try and get to 1,000. We try and get to 100,000. Then we try and get to a million uh, uh, subscribers, man. And we're going to do it together, baby. I appreciate the love, support. Hey, <clears throat> I try to reach out to everybody as quick as I can, as quick as possible. I try to respond to all the comments as quick as I can, as quick as uh, possible. Sometimes they, I get overwhelmed by the comments. There'll be a lot of them sometimes. So if I, if I don't get to you right away, I apologize. But I will get you as soon as possible, man. Just remember that. Man, I appreciate the love and support. Man, we doing this together, baby. Grown man business.